Um, now I'm going to go on to eyeliners and eye products. I don't really use much eyeshadow, um, but you've probably see, seen I purchased the MUA uh, Undress Me 2 palette the other day. It's really, really, really nice. I love it. And I've just bought eyeliner, eyeliner and eyeshadow since I bought it. It's really nice. Um, I apply that with the eyeshadow potion primer from Urban Decay. Um, I've just got this little old one. But it just makes the pigments a lot nicer and it's really, really nice eyeshadows for like £4. So I really enjoy really like that. Um, I wear eyeliner every single day and I wear the uh, Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in black. I don't think it's called black. In zero. And uh, that lasts all day which is really good. And then Rimmel Exaggerate Eyeliner which is my liquid eyeliner which if you see any of my face posts, Instagram posts or outfit posts or anything you'll see that I wear eyeliner every single day. So that's a must have. It just it's just so easy to apply. Sometimes um liquid eyeliners don't agree with my eyes and make me water, make them water and stuff, so but that works, so I rebuy that all the time. Um mascara at the moment I'm using Benefit They're Real and Benefit Bad Girl Lash. I use these together, I apply that first, and then I apply the um, bad girl lash on top to make them a bit more volumized. Um I'm not I don't I like their real, but on its own it doesn't do anything for me. It's really good, it really lengthens your lashes, but I just I like a bit of volume. So I use two mascaras all the time. Um before Bad Girl Lash I was using the Soap and Glory um thick and fast mascara and that's really good as well. Bad girl Ga Bad Girl Lash, I've just got this um, sample size, but I probably I'm gonna free buy that, repurchase that, because it is really, really good. It's one of those things that um I always see it and don't buy it, but I really should. So yeah, that's that. And um, concealer, I use collection um, concealer that everyone uses, just because it's so easy to use. And what I do with this, I probably need a new one. <laughs> I um, apply this under the eyes and just on my chin because I have quite um, breakout on my chin. And then I have. Um, I use the um, Real Techniques foundation brush just to um, rub that in, just to like rub it in nicely, blend it in nicely into my skin and I do the same with my chin. Then I apply my foundation and then I use the brush and a little bit more concealer to build it up if I need to. So that's my concealer. Um, I think we're going to lips now. Um, I'm not a big one for lips, I don't wear many lip products but recently I've um, bought a few MAC lipsticks and I bought the Apocalypse collection. Well, I bought a few from the Apocalypse collection from Rimmel. Um, so I've been using these three. These three religiously. Um, I did a post about these a few weeks ago, so just have a look for that. I have Nova, Nude Eclipse and Luna. And I love them. They were the colours that I looked at online and loved. And then I went and bought them and I still love them. They're just great. Um, pigmentation it's just really really nice lip gloss it just lasts for ages and I really enjoy wearing them and then my matte collection is slowly growing I've picked up a few um, lipsticks I bought two off a blog sale I bought, I bought Pink Nivea and Speed Dial and I really really like both of those and I've been wearing them like loads since I got them it's just those two there they're just amazing. Like I always thought, like fourteen pounds for a lipstick, like couldn't justify it, but it, they are just so good. And then I got this one, which is Angel, and Dan bought me this for Valentine's Day. And then I've got um another one, Creme de Nude or something, but that's in my own handbag, which I don't know where that is. <laughs> um, and then finally, um. Brow kits. I I never did it, used to do anything to my brows, and then recently I've started using brow kits. I have the sleek brow kit, which is this one here, which is really handy because you get the brushes and the tweezers with it, and you get the wax and the powder, and it's just so handy to just have in your bag because it's just easy to use. It's all there. It's brilliant, and it's got a really big mirror, 
so I love that. And then I've got HD brows, it's in really bad condition. I bought that on um, a blog sale and I do use it all the time. Uh, it's really handy, it's really nice, like, because I've got blonde hair, if I want a lighter tone, then it's really good to use. Um, also, just one last thing, um, a couple of brushes that I use. Uh, these are all in my jar <laughs> that you've probably seen on my blog. Um, I have the Real Techniques um, powder brush. I bought that the other day and I've used it non-stop since I got it. I love it. Just puts your powder on really, really light. And I use that with the Clinique powder, which is this one here. It's just loose powder. I think it was like £20 and it's just so good because it's lasted me so long. The only thing with loose powder is it does go everywhere. But I really, really, really like that. And then I use the... Um, I use the Real Techniques Brow Brush, this one here. I use that to put my wax on. And then I use this little brush here, which is from Kelly Brook Collection in New Look. And I use that to apply the powder to my eyebrows. And then um, another brush that I use is this one here. It's an Echo Tools brush. It's, just, it's a foundation brush, but I actually use this to apply my highlighter. Just like here, here, and then to the cheek here. So that's the brush I use to apply my highlighter. And then I use these two brushes here for my eyeshadows. Uh, this is the Real Techniques brush um, that comes in the collection that I did a post about today. And that's the Doomed Shadow brush. Doomed Shadow brush. And then this is just a really cheap brush that I can't even remember where I got it from. But I use this to apply like my base to my eyeshadow and then I use that one to do the corners. Um, so that's it really. That's all my skincare and my makeup and my brushes. And I hope you enjoyed that video and I'll see you soon. Thank you, bye.